Five acres of offices, training rooms, and labs. It's not for the latest tech company coming to the triangle. No, it is not. It is for one of the state's number one industries, agriculture and agribusiness. CBS 17's Brea Hollingsworth live right now in Raleigh, where she just got an inside look at this new facility. Pretty impressive stuff here, Brea. Yeah, the Steve Troxler Agricultural Science Center combines five different labs into one. The building is instrumental when it comes to food safety in North Carolina. With more than five acres of offices, training rooms, and labs, the Steve Troxler Agricultural Science Center is open for business. Agriculture and agribusiness is this, uh, the state's number one industry at a, uh, probably about $95.9 .9 billion of economic impact. The building, named after State Agriculture Commissioner Steve Troxler, it replaces seven facilities used by the department's Food and Drug Protection, Standards, and Veterinary Development. Divisions. Troxler told me he wanted to design a building that those who specialize in agriculture would need. We're responsible for animal health. So when something happens to an animal in North Carolina, particularly in the food chain, we need to find out why and what uh, and jump on it very quickly. Labs in the facility conduct tests pertaining to food safety, animal disease, weights, and measures. Uh, you think about outbreaks of uh, salmonella, E. coli. Uh, that's all something that is under the preview of the Department of Agriculture. Food safety is one of our major missions, so uh, we have ensured that uh, we're going to have a, a safe food supply for the future for our children and grandchildren. And just so you get an idea of how much of an impact this building has, agribusiness makes up about 17% of the state's workforce. In Raleigh, Brea Hollingsworth, CBS 17 News. Yeah, it's pretty interesting to see so many things grouped together at once, kind of make everything work hand in hand the way it does in the yeah. industry. Uh, Brea, thank you.